Hi guys, welcome back to another episode on Team Titan. I'm Denise and you might have seen me on Class T1-T5 basically playing myself. And today, I'm going to be playing a dollar question. So I will be given 6 minutes to answer as many questions as I can. For every question answered, I get a dollar. Now I've been waiting to play this game for 1-2 to two years. I hope that I don't disappoint you guys and I hope that I get to break the record for most number of questions answered. Let's go! If you could live anywhere in the world, where would you choose? Denmark. I actually stayed there for 6 months because I was studying there, so I miss the place a lot. What is your biggest fear? I'm really scared of people around me dying, but I'm also super scared of cockroaches and when they fly, I feel like my soul leaves my body. What made you go into tutoring? I just really like teaching. Uh, I really like math and I like working with kids and I know that having a good teacher really helps to inspire kids. I want to be that for all my students. Say hello in all the languages you know. Hello. Ni hao. That's it. What makes you laugh the most? Nigel, my partner, he's super funny. I'm always laughing around him. What is 76 plus 49? Plus 50 minus 1. 1, 2, 5. Can your tongue touch your elbow? I have a very long tongue, but I don't think so. Nope. What's your first and current impression of Jian Hao? Intelligent, very wise, and also fiercely loyal. What is your biggest rebel as a teenager? I used to wear the old T1, T5 uniform, the one with the pinafore. So there was a period of time I wanted to look cool, so I ripped the belt off the pinafore so that I can change the position. My mother really ripped me for that. <laughs> Should Shaq marry Jian Hao, Vincent, Leonard? Uh, okay, I would shoot. Leonard, I would marry Tian Hao Shek Vincent. What are your hobbies? I like to read. Uh, I'm always on Reddit and I'm reading very random things. I have the most random facts in my head. What is your least favourite food? Vinegar, anything with vinegar. I hate the smell of it. How long have you been together with your fiancé? In March, we have been together for 8 years. How did you both meet? We met in class, we met in uni. We took the same class and we, were, we basically sat diagonally from each other. First day of class, we met eye contact and then that was it. What is the cutest moment that happened between you and your students? I can't really choose one moment, but my students, they do give me a lot of thank you notes and I keep all of them. So every time I have a bad day, I take them out to read it again and it keeps me going. How did you meet Jian Hao? We started DMing each other on IG and he asked me to come down for a trial shoot. And then, now I'm here. What's your pin number? Zero, 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 zero. Who is your best friend in Titan? Debbie. I can tell her a lot of things. What was your strongest subject in school? Strangely, not math. It was actually GP, General Paper and JC, which is a lot of essay writing. Who is your favourite character from Class N4 T1? Christabel. I think she's very funny. She's very happy. What is your favourite local dish? Hokkien Mee. I like the one, the, the Rolex uncle that cooks the Hokkien Mee. Have you ever failed your exams in school? Yes, many times. But it's okay. It's very normal to fail. It's what you do after. That matters. Who is your favourite teacher in Class T1, T5? Miss Shirley. If you could hire someone to help you, what would it be for? To manage my schedule. Uh, I have a very packed timetable, so it will really help. What is your fondest memory of 2021? So I just opened my own tuition centre and on the last day of Reno, I remember just sitting inside and feeling so much gratitude and feeling a lot of happiness. Who would you want to be stranded on a deserted island with and why? Bear Grylls because he can help me survive. What's the first thing you'll do if you get $1 million? I think I'll buy a house. What was your first impression of Vincent? Vincent, annoying. What do you dislike about your work? The hours get very long, and I think it gets quite tiring. How do you do in university? I graduated with first class honours for two degrees. Mum or dad? Mum. In your opinion, who is the most good looking person in Titan? Oh my goodness, this hard. Juhi, I think. Effortlessly pretty. When do you plan to have kids? Maybe one to two years. I already have the baby names planned. What's the most unusual food you've ever eaten? I've had whale meat in Iceland. Very strange meat. <laughs> what do you do to keep fit? I try to exercise. I try. <laughs> Not as much as I would like to. What is one quote you live by? I want to put the ding in the universe. I think Steve Jobs said that. Which countries have you visited and which is your favourite? Japan, Indonesia, Denmark, uh, Germany, Malaysia. Uh, Denmark is my favourite. What are the three words that you would use to describe yourself? I'm quite introverted, driven and practical. Do you see yourself doing what you're currently doing in 10 years' time? Yes. Uh, puzzle, situation, I love it so much. I plan to expand. What's a fun fact about you that not a lot of people know about? I can move the bones on my knuckles and on both hands. If you could have any superpowers, what superpower would you choose? I want to teleport. Who is your favourite character in class T1-T5? 
I think Ben. I think uh, F he's so effortless. His character is so funny. Are you a nerd in real life as well? Yes, very much so. Very alike to my character in T1, T5. What's the longest you've gone without sleep and why? 48 hours. Uh, I think it was some uni assignment and we're just uh, up all night. How long does it take for you to get ready in the morning? Depends. Uh, if I'm rushing, 10 minutes. If I'm taking my own sweet time, 1 hour. If you were the president of Singapore, what is the first law that you would introduce? Maybe uh, equal education for all. Like abolish streaming maybe. How did you join Titan? Jia reached out to me and then I went to his place for a trial shoot. On a scale of 1 to 10, how funny would you say you are? Uh, a 2, 2 out of 10. <laughs> what was your first job? I was a server at Blue Works restaurant. What do you think is your spirit animal? Hamster, uh, very lazy but uh, at night lots of energy. Who do you wish followed you back on Instagram? No one really. When you're not working, how would you spend your free time? I'm either taking a nap, or I'm watching YouTube, or I'm on Reddit. And I'm re reading lots of random things. What is the best piece of advice you have been given? Keep on keeping on, even when the going gets tough. Say something to motivate everyone who is stressed out. You can do it, don't give up. What's the best pickup line you've ever heard? Honestly, nothing. No one has ever used pickup lines on me. If you could eat one food for the rest of your life, what would it be? Sambal stingray. I've had a really good sambal stingray uh, from Malaysia and I could eat that for the rest of my life. What is the strangest dream you've ever had? Once I dreamed that someone was trying to kill me and then I was hiding under the bed. Really terrified. Have you ever had a supernatural encounter? I don't think so. I think uh, I've been lucky enough not to, but I've, I've had friends who have. What do you do when you are unable to fall asleep? I like to read horror stories on this subreddit. It's called No Sleep. What skill do you wish you had? I wish I could survive on lesser sleep. If you were a singer, what would your stage name be? Singer? Me? <laughs> Denise? What was the last expensive purchase you've made? Oh, and I paid for the renovation for the tuition centre. How has your day been so far? Great, I'm here. What's your phone password? Honestly, I don't even know. It's, the, it's a pattern. It's like a triangle. What is the last YouTube video you've watched? I was watching some, some math riddle this morning. What? What's your favourite drink from Starbucks? Toffee nut crunch latte, but you can only get it during the Christmas season. If you could go back in time, what's the one thing that you would tell yourself? I'll tell myself to work harder when I'm in JC and don't look at boys so much. Do you own any pets? I used to, but they both passed away of old age. What is your dream job? Dream job? Oh, I really love what I'm doing now. I like teaching. That's my dream job. <laughs> oh, that was fast. So, how many questions did I get? You've answered 69 questions. 69? So, what are you going to do with the $69? I think, uh, since we're all here, let's just buy bubble tea for everyone in the studio right now. So thank you for watching this episode of A Dollar A Question. I hope that you enjoyed watching it. Let us know down in the comments below what you want to see next. Remember to subscribe and also watch our latest video. And I'll see you soon. Bye-bye!